Let's shift, because y'all right about that, but let's shift. There's an ec- epidemic going on. And I, mean, I ain't going to lie. As a musician that does sound at church, too, I find it. I'm not a purist. Uh, I know some sound men that are drummers that are purists that want to hear that real drum. But there are some, there's an epidemic now where churches are replacing their real drums. With triggers? Not with just triggers, but with whole electric drum sets now. Rolling V drums. Uh, yeah, just getting a left and a right <laughs> into the, into the, and uh, save a lot of time, a lot of work. How y'all feel about electric drums instead of uh, for live events? Like, electric drums. Woo. I mean, to be honest, I'm definitely biased with electric drums as a whole. But electric drums honestly made me some money on the kid. So it's it's a it's a <laughs> it's it's a catch twenty two. Like dang, I, I mean I do I'm not gonna lie, I do not like electric drums. Hybrid drums, I'm all for. A full electric kit, throw it away. Yeah, it would be better to do hybrid. Just to have a little bit of everything, but just I okay. ain't gonna say no name. Well, speaking about gigs, let's shift into this one then. Um, what was the worst gear-wise gig you've ever performed situation? Like, you came in there, it was a snare and a hi-hat, no kick drum. Teresa, that's sad. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, man, it's... And how did you get through the gig? We'll start with you, Larry. Josh, thinking. The, the funniest thing is it's a recent one for me. Like... You got these backline companies, the smaller, smaller cities, excuse me. You got all these backline companies that are starting out. Uh, and they're, they're pitching themselves like, yeah, we got gear. Um, and they don't have gear. They have the, the lowest the ba- brand of drums, Poplar Wood. They bring in Poplar Wood as a professional kit and renting it out at a professional price. <laughs> <laughs> and you get there, <laughs> and you just look at the set and be like, this is what I'm working with. So, and I mean, and sadly, I learned some tricks. Me and Gav Tape are best friends. Um, <laughs> and uh, one dude literally was like, man, you got the set sounding great. And I'm like, yeah, man, you know, the Gav Tape. And I went a little point Dexter with it. I was like, the Gav Tape works with the drum heads, if you understand it. I was like, if you know what you're doing with the gaff tape, you can get it to sound like a two-ply, which then gives your drums a little life when you need it. And he was like, oh, OK. I'm like, yeah, but these drums should be here. <laughs> but, <laughs> since they're here, we're going to have to figure this out. OK. You might have to do a video on gaff tape on, on, on that. because so try that, to get sponsored. That's, that's I mean, a good one. That's a, yeah, that's listen a now. Mm. It's, so gaff tape, what's, it, it essentially does what gels would do. It does what gels would do, but a little better. Okay, you've been playing drums with life support. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Come on, Josh. Mr. Drum Class. Do you have gigs or lessons? <laughs> Those gigs. Most of them, I was there. Yeah, so I'm going to let them know if you lie. <laughs> But I, I'll curve ball to you. When did I have a decent kid in these games? Dang, dang, oh, hey, I'll so, wait. I'll, that's a good one. And that says it all. It they definitely need to update, does. up their game. Jesus, invest in some gear. But I, the question was the worst. What was the worst? Can't say no names. It was a revival. <laughs> Doing a hey, praise, he doing a praise please, break. We need, we he, need he, violence. He, 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 he want to say them names. <laughs> he, a, he said it was, it was 1895, <laughs> 7 o'clock, it was a revival. Uh, we was waiting on God. He didn't get there yet. <laughs> we was outside. But, uh, the temperature was. What song was it? That, that <laughs> Praise break. <laughs> it wasn't a break of love. Praise break. No. Hey, the exact moment to the a snare thing. was fine. <laughs> so the only thing on the drum set good was the snare. Yeah, cause was the, this a Chris Dave drum set? <laughs> no, nah, the times were terrible, so I I didn't even touch those. Mm. And uh, you know, obviously the kick drum went out. We had duct tape, went right through it. <laughs> I ain't never hit the cymbals that long. 
I'm glad that was a thing now to take the kick oh, yeah, out. Yeah, you can definitely get away with it. So, yeah. It was cold to come. Yeah. Dang, I might have gave him up. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't help it though. <laughs> Them symbols is Kojic, bro. Yeah, it was definitely a $20 kit. Yeah.